Hello everyone welcome to my channel today we are going to look into a topic which is known as finding number of character variables in SAS let us try to understand this through an example here i have a data stack in which i have five variables out of these five variables we have three character variables and here without looking into this data set for all the variables we should have a program which tells me how many character variables are that is the goal here it is simple because we have only five variables and we can easily look through what if we have 200 variables this all thing becomes quite complicated now how do we solve this problem here one way to do is to take the help of array what is a sas array sas array is something which helps us to reference group of variables which belong to same data type now i have made lots of videos on sas arrays and what you can do in the sas arrays and playlist for those sas arrays i will give in the link in the description below for purpose of this video we can do it simply by using array keyword followed by array name and then writing underscore character underscore when we mention underscore character underscore we are accessing all the character variables that is we are accessing var1 var2 and sub variables now we can apply dim function on this array name and this gives us how many variables are there in this particular array and as we have mentioned underscore character underscore it tells us how many character variables are there now let us quickly run both of these steps and see our result and in here you can see that we have three variables which are character variables here we have got our result but for doing that what we have also done is we have read whole of this data set say for example this data set is a huge data set it is not very efficient to read this whole data set just for knowing how many character variables are there we can modify our code simply by using if zero then set ds instead of just writing set ds what this if zero then set ds does is it will not read the data and also during compilation phase it sets all the variables but no data is read i have made a very detailed video on this topic link for the same i will give in the description below and then everything else is same as i do not want other variable information what i can do is simply i can use this particular variable in my keep statement now let us quickly run this and see our result and in the result you can see that we have three variables that's all for this topic if you like this topic please give it a thumbs up share and subscribe thank you